Hi, this is Nancy from Life's Blessing Sun Home School. Today we're going to be looking at the Singapore Primary Mathematics U.S. Edition. So this is not aligned to Common Core. We're going to look at the 2A textbook and the workbook and how they correlate. And then I'm going to give you a flip through of each. And I'll be doing the 2B textbook and workbook in a separate video. So. Um, you can look for that in the description link below once this video is posted. Hopefully I will have the other one posted shortly and I will leave that in the description link. So let's get started with the textbook first. I'm going to go back and show you the preface page, the table of contents and all that good stuff. But I just want to show you right now of how this correlates with the workbook. So um, right here you see it says, workbook exercise one. So this lesson, lesson number one, correlates with the workbook exercise one. I love that they put that in the bottom of the page. That way you see that right away. You don't have to go searching for it. So that's the table of contents for this that we'll look at in a bit. This is exercise one. So whenever you get finished teaching this lesson to your child, then you would go to your workbook, exercise one. And then that's your exercise two. So you just do exercise one, which is front and back here, and then one page here, and then that would be your exercise two. So each one would be marked like that. So this goes to exercise two once you get finished teaching this. So now I'm going to go and do a flip through of the textbook for 2A. Here's your preface. You can slow this down or speed it up however you would like. Here's your table of contents. That's your first lesson. There starts your second. Remember to give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. I'm homeschool mom of two children, six-year-old boy that will be going into second grade very, very soon, and a five-year-old girl who will be starting kindergarten very, very soon. So I would love to help you out if you are just getting started homeschooling. I don't claim to be an expert or anything like that, but we have been homeschooling now for two years. We've really, really enjoyed it, and I love to help others. So it would be great to have you as a part of our YouTube family. If you're already a part of our YouTube family, then thank you so, so much. We really appreciate your support. As soon as I get done doing the textbook, I am going to go ahead and show you into the workbook of 2A. So stay tuned for that. This is not the end of the video. <laughs> There's still a little bit more. We're halfway done. So 
Sorry about that. Get ginger. Seems like the last couple of videos my cats wanted in on it, so. <laughs> Shut the door right there. Yes. Sorry, I'm missing the table of contents here on the workbook. So this is the workbook now. Here's our table of contents. And then we start exercise one. You can see that the, while the textbook was very, very colorful, the workbook is not which I know that's helpful for a lot of students, and then a lot of students really enjoy the color, so maybe you could get your child to color their work page. I've heard of a lot of moms that do that, so. Thank you so much for sticking with us thus far. As you can see from a lot of this material, Singapore is a bit advanced and it's pretty in depth. So you can go to their website at singaporemath.com and you can check where your child is at by doing the placement test. A lot of times it's not necessary for the child to actually do the placement test. As moms, we can kind of look over the material and find out where our child is. So rather than having them answer a bunch of questions, you could kind of glance at it and see where your child is because you know what your child has just finished learning. So. And like I said before, I am going to be doing a separate video for textbook and workbook to B. So as soon as I post it, then I will try to edit the description box of this video and link it down below. So we are ending this video. Almost done with this book. And we thank you so, so much for watching. I think you kind of get the idea. <laughs> go back and rewind or you can like I said slow down the speed if you want to thank you so much for watching and God bless have a wonderful wonderful day